It was me. It wasn't you, Jim. It wasn't me? No. It was Chris. No, I'm just messing with you. Oh, Jesus. come on, man, really? No one's got a sense of humor around here? Oh, no, 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 what was it? It was a side-by-side. Side-by-side? Old Red? It was the ATV that burnt the barn, it wasn't me! The ego on me to think that I could burn a barn with my explosive internal strife and struggle. A jerk. Don't tell Chris I said that. Where did it start? Where this positive battery cable comes from the battery right. was rubbing on this sharp edge of the side-by-side -side and enough heat generated starting on fire and that spread to the rest of the side-by-side. -side. Well, that makes sense then, because then this went up and it burned the awning. So that awning held in the heat, which was wood on the bottom, and just pushed it towards the barn. And it started the wood siding on the barn on fire and then spread into the rest of the barn. The fire started outside. Yes. That's why I thought maybe somebody threw a Molotov cocktail or something that started it. And those are things we don't rule out. We use our expertise and our knowledge based on fire pattern evidence to really determine what the cause and origin of that fire is. And the scene remaining gave us the ability to look at all that evidence in a pristine condition to really narrow the fire down. This fire was probably started by the arcing battery cable on the firewall. You let me down, girl. Big rusty red now. Well, Mark, case closed. Yeah. Need anything? Let me know. Oh, you guys are the best. Thank man. you, Mark. Thanks, Chris, you're welcome. Appreciate it, you guys. Uh,